the, ooh, that light is just so horrible this early in the morning. So it's like, well, I don't know. For me, it's morning time. I work at nights. So anyways, welcome to a mask Monday. And we are going to use the Spa April Bath and Shower Mermaid Face Mask. I think I saw Chelsea Ganey do this. And we're going to go over um, some stuff I got in the mail. And two items that I got from Amazon to review, which were actually kind of good, I'm surprised. Okay. What is this supposed to do? Citrus, and it doesn't smell like citrus. It smells nice and soapy. Okay. I'm full. 15, 20 minutes. Okay. So, let's see. Oh, uh, okay. The one I saw her do, whoever it was, I'm so sorry, looked different than this one did. The scales were like a lot bigger and the mask was white. It's one of these papery ones. I hope this is not a papery one. <sighs> oh. Mermaid vibes. I love the ocean, but I'm not into the mermaid thing. Not really. I'm more like into sharks, octopus. Um, and my favorites are whales. I love me some whales and seahorses. I think they're cute. But yeah, I'm not, I'm not all, I mean, I'm not here to diss a mermaid. It's just not my liking. Stop. Okay, so if my puppy lets me, we can go ahead and get started. I got two cards. Okay. Tracy put my mail on the couch and my dog ate it. So this is from Flex Beauty. She gave me a lip scrub to try out. And we're going to try it out when we do this mask. Once I take it off. Okay, so um, her her link is in my description box. I put it in there. It's going to stay in there. Um, and um, yeah, I am fixing to get the foundation because I used the foundation and it was super bomb. Let me see. Which one did I use? I used the porcelain one and that, that one worked really good for my pasty ass skin. And it was, I didn't need a lot. Okay, the next one I got, so thank you, Megan, for the sample. The next one I got, I got from Renee. Mount Rainier, Washington. I love Renee. She lives right next to this. She sees it every day on her way to work. She always has, she always shows us, like, on Marco Polo, her, like, when it looks at sunfall, I mean, um, you know, when sunrise and sunfall and from dusk to dawn and with snow and without it's just really beautiful i love i just love that view that is so pretty so i still have hers that she sent me a while back this is the same thing with snow on it it just always looks different depending on the sun and the lighting and i think it's so beautiful and she sent me a christmas card my dog ate the tip of it i'm so sorry renee she sends me one every year, and I really love them. I appreciate it so, so much. Thank you so much, Renee. You are so cute. Oh, my gosh. And then there's there's the mountain. Stop. You know, she doesn't live too far from where the Goonies. Um, I forgot what it was called. Okay. So, next round. I got friend mail. But it's not friend mail. If it makes any sense, I'm not going to say who did it. You know who you are, and I appreciate it very, very much. Um, so the, the first thing I want to show is these earrings. These are like clip-ons, but they're screw-ons. Um, I have a hard time with these. I try to rebuild them. But the problem is, is I would have to totally dis discard this top piece because the hole that connects to this one is a solid piece that goes with the whole top like these are antique earrings and they actually belonged to sue's mother so there's those and then um along with that i got some um elephant earrings um they're not up here right now then i got this scale mail necklace which is made by delia lafay i have the earrings now, does that look flashy or what? Look at the freaking detail. And you can find Delia LaFay's jewelry and scale mail. And she she actually has models that wear it on runways for gothic festivals. 
Um, and you can find this on Etsy. Etsy. You can find this on there. Ooh, it's so freaking nice, isn't it? Okay. And then the next one she gave me was this. Yup a dub a doo. <laughs> <What's this? laughs> um, Flintstones Gothic. <laughs> Love it. I think this is pretty cool. But I'm pretty sure I'm going to make me something else out of it. Because I usually, if it's jewelry that I know I'm not going to wear, um, I will definitely turn it into something else. Now I'm going to keep this the way it is because this is a genuine handmade, handcrafted, detailed uh, item. And I have the metric earrings. So here's another scale mail piece. I'm not sure if this is also from her. I would think so because it also has kind of like the same kind of how does she do that and it's got these little spikes I like that too then I got two bath bombs with glitter on it two tomato masks I got a bracelet this one just clap it open right here fits me very nice got that and uh, then I got these Little bags with like, um, is that a barrette? Oh, with some candy and an elephant necklace. That's pretty. Okay, and two tomato masks. All right, I put this away. And now I'm gonna show you what I got to review from Amazon. Okay, so I got, uh oh, where'd I put it? Oh, there it is. I have like, for my keychain, I have a big foxtail and I have one of those rings the foxtail is on the ring and the keys are on there. And so I just slip it over my arm. I never forget it, never leave it laying anywhere. It just hangs there. And it's easy for me to find in my purse. I just grab the foxtail or the ring and I have it. But I've been wanting one of these. And so um, a company asked me to review this and it came with one of these and I was like, oh yeah, I'll review it. Okay, so first off, you can use this as a separate keychain, and this comes unattached you attach it yourself this is to protect yourself you know ah bitch get away and um i like these these are made out of rubber and have these cute little sunflowers and there's just one way to win the only thing that i dislike about it i have i'm not too sure about the sturdiness because this is a rubber band like my ring is a solid ass ring like it's hard it's solid you know and it's got leather to cover up the ring so you know that thing ain't gonna break this with a rough person like me that's where my concerns are but it's really pretty i like how it feels um nonetheless this is mine i'm keeping this uh, i need this so i i don't know out of out of five stars i'd probably get it give it four it took two months to get here so now here's the other thing I got. Um, I was hit up to review. Some people call it PR. No, honey, it's not PR. If it's from American Influencer Box or whatever, or Amazon, it's not PR. PR is when a company sends you a release before it's released so you can review it. Um, this is a review. So I get review points, okay? Um, and... First, well, this is a long flannel jacket, right? Which I was like, okay, so I ordered the Burberry colors, which is like the beige, black and white. I don't know why they sent me the orange, black and white. Nonetheless, it's still cute. So I'm gonna show you what it looks like. Here's my, oh snap, bitch. Okay, it fits really good. I got a size medium, it's a little big. So I would just order true to size if I were you. I did roll up the arms because I don't like that straight look. It does not have any stretch to it. Just very, very little. See, just very, very little. And it has no lining. But it's still very comfortable. You can wear it perfectly in the house. Or just jump in your car and go somewhere really quick when it's a little cold. The best part is... It fucking has pockets. Like, that means the world to me. Because uh, it's just like I'm going to have a hoodie. It's got to have that, you know, that little spat right there. And uh, let me go backwards here so you can see a little bit more. I'm up in pajamas. Look at me, I look so crazy. But this is this is it. And I can just see with like a white shirt, 
you know, some boots and some, some tight black pants and hoops and shit that would be looking all right, you know? I would definitely not go to the gas station looking like this. Um, but I have gone to the gas station in my pajamas before. But this is really, really comfortable. I don't know how it's going to be after I wash it. See, like when I'm sitting here, this has a little stretch. But in the width area, it doesn't. So, like, if I were to button it up, this is how much room I still have left. All of this. Well, just about not like that. All of this is extra. But none, I mean, I kind of like oversized. I kind of, you know, I just really wish it was the color that I ordered instead of having to go through the same shit and return it and stuff. So I'm just going to do my honest review on there and I'm going to say wrong color came, but I still like it. And um, I like everything about it. I really do. So uh, a lot of times when I get things for review, I'll review them and then I save them for Christmas or birthday presents. I don't know. My mom's coming next week. If she likes it, if she really likes it, she can have it. Because, you know, I like to spoil my mom. Okay, so I'm going to take this off because this is drying out. And I am really, really glad that it is not, my face isn't fully drenched. Because then I can just, you know, just sit back and relax and not have all this shit all over my face. But anyways, that's it for my Mask Monday. And I hope you guys go check out the playlist in the description box. And I'll see you next week in the next Mask Monday.